Hey, I am back today to do a tiny little Vitacost order. I only recently started ordering off of Vitacost. I feel like this was a very big thing a few years ago in the like health and wellness um, community. A lot of people now talk about like Thrive Market and stuff like that, but I'm just behind the times. Um, Vitacost is cool because it has lots of different, all sorts of different wellness things from inexpensive to very expensive and it has all sorts of things um, ranging from supplements to household goods to snacks things like that so it's super cool I will leave a link to the website before I'm sure a lot of people have heard of it before Thrive Market actually sounds really cool but it's it's more similar to like a Costco or something where you pay for a membership per year I think and then you get discounted stuff I just don't tend to order so much of that because I do have a really good natural grocers here but I think maybe I'll get more into it I'm not sure so just jumping in my order is it's pretty small but I just I got some really good stuff so I wanted to mention it the first thing is just a replacement order I got just the plain nature made you can buy this at like Target or anywhere I have a weird hair um, and I got turmeric with the curcumin in it. I think that's how you say that. Um, this is supposed to be very good for inflammation. Just, just in general, turmeric and um, ginger are supposed to be really good for you to cook with and all of that for inflammation. But I take it in supplement form. I had some issues which will lead to another purchase that I made um, in the fall. It was in October. Yes, it was in October. I do have tendonitis in one of my knees and my both of my knees and my ankles just got so inflamed. They were like swollen and all this stuff. So I'm like Googling like, what do you do? Because I eat pretty well. I don't um, hardcore exercise or anything like that, but I just was really struggling and I don't really deal with physical ailments at all. So it's kind of a new thing for me. So I've been taking these. I take one every day. That's according to the directions. There's all sorts of different ones. And I've just stuck with this brand because I don't really know that much about supplements in terms of brands and like what's good and what's not. So I'm just kind of starting with this brand. This is, was about $9. Um, so then leading from that, when my knees, knees and ankles started to get inflamed, I started looking up joint support and all of that. And I just happen to be near, I don't live near a Whole Foods, like the closest one is like three and a half hours away. Um, but I happen to be near one. And so I decided to dive in and try vital proteins, collagen peptides. Now, if you follow anybody on Instagram or anybody on social media who does anything with wellness, they've definitely mentioned these. The PR for this has been crazy, but it is a really, really great brand and supplement so collagen is really good people have been talking about that a lot especially with like paleo diet being so popular and um bone broth and all of that stuff but just regular like collagen peptides these ones are really great i've also tried the great lakes brand which i think i might like more um they're basically tasteless you can taste them in a in water but it it tastes like something's there but like not anything gross or weird, but I actually just put this in my coffee just like everybody else. I blend it up in my cold coffee. I've mentioned that in my what I eat in a days. Um, and basically collagen is just really good for your joint support. It does all different types of things. You can read about what collagen does for you. It can affect your like gut health and all of that stuff. So I, this is expensive though. This big one is $43 on Vitacost, which is the best price that I was able to find. I think the smaller size was the original one I got. And that one I want to say was about 30 or 35 at Whole Foods. Obviously Whole Foods is a little more expensive, but um, it has just all sorts of good stuff in it. And the one thing that I, so I struggle a lot with like using animal products. I still do use animal products, but I try to be super, super conscious of quality. And um, you can read about like how they feel about that. And also this plastic I believe is BPA free, which is kind of cool because you really don't see that very often. Um, but it was nice to be able to support a brand that does. Uh, the next thing is another supplement. I finally got some organic wheatgrass. Wheatgrass is really interesting. 
it has I think something like all of the minerals known to man or something in it it has a lot of benefits it tastes very green um, and obviously with the powder I'll show you the it's very like dark and murky and I mean it tastes very very green I would definitely recommend trying this before you buy it if you can if you have any sort of like natural health foods and stuff a lot of times they have these in single packets but I've just been trying to use it it's it's good for your digestion it's good for like boosting your immunity I do this a couple times a week last week was Thanksgiving and I started to feel like we had illness in the house and then I started to feel sick so I was doing this every single day I just do it right away in the morning I do squeeze lemon juice in it to make it a little more palatable the powder obviously uh, does have that kind of powdery feel to it kind of like in a protein shake or whatever but this is was good and it was it's a good price I think it was about $20 and there's a ton of uses in here it says it's about 30 scoops so that's a decent amount especially if you're not doing it every day so I started to edit this video and I realized that I left out one product that I got on Vitacost I bought another one of these it's Andalou Naturals and it is their lash and lid makeup remover this one has vitamin C in it allegedly well not allegedly it's probably there but um, I love this stuff so so much it's such a good eye makeup remover and the reason that I bought it because it was a little bit cheaper it was about nine dollars but this tube actually lasts me quite a while you can also find this at Marshall's TJ Maxx those kind of places or just like your regular you know health food store or whatever Angelou Naturals is nice because it's a good quality company I wanted to make sure that I mentioned this product as well because I love this for taking off my eye makeup I like taking my eye makeup off separately from the rest of my face makeup I just put like one pump onto a cotton round takes it right off so I just wanted to make sure I mentioned that because I like to mention things that are really good decent price point and that have a cleaner ingredient list so on with the rest of the haul um, the last two products are the same basically um, but they're great household products if you want your home to smell good but you don't want to use a lot of chemicals so I have seen this brand a lot you can find these again at a lot of health food stores it's just this Oracacia brand I think that's how you say it and I got peaceful patchouli and sweet orange this does make your house smell a little bit like patchouli but in the nicest way possible I always feel like it smells like a little bit like a hippie here but like in a good way not in an overbearing way and then I also got the sensual cinnamon and ylang ylang I never know actually how to say that this one smells really really different than what I expected I wanted it to smell warmer cinnamon it doesn't but I do really like this um so basically I just wanted some air fresheners to spray around the home these it says there's no synthetic ingredients they're paraben and petroleum free not tested on animals and basically they just have like essential oils in them and liquids so it's like this one has water sweet orange oil ylang ylang oil allspice berry oil and then cinnamon bark oil so it's just very like straightforward it doesn't seem to like stain anything when I'm spraying I I keep this one actually in the bedroom and I just kind of like oh you can see my setup I just kind of like spray it around and it doesn't leave like oily spots or anything just an FYI but that is my tiny haul I am have loved I like get so excited about health products and I'm so excited that I can finally do my first Vitacost haul how exciting um so yeah if you have any recommendations or if you have anything that you've been interested in health wise or you found like a cool product like I was super pumped about these when I found these pretty inexpensive too I didn't mention that but I think these were about five or six dollars and so if you have any cool like obsession things or things that I should look up as well I would appreciate you telling me those as well everybody gives me such good suggestions so thank you for watching this tiny haul thank you for listening to all my rambles I'm excited that I was able to do this today and I hope you have a happy and healthy day today see you later bye